to the Age Caulfield Guineas Day. I'm Maggie Wish and today we'll be taking you to see all the fun, colour and excitement here at Caulfield. We'll head into the Fashion and Entertainment Precinct where we'll chat to the Chadston Fashion Stakes winners. We'll see who's out and about in the new boulevard and of course we're going to be talking backstage to Sneaky Sound System. That's all happening here at Caulfield so stay tuned. Hello, I'm Katie Murphy and I'm here today with Jenny Beard, the winner of the Stylish Ladies Fashion Stakes at Caulfield. Jenny, do you like to tell us a bit about your outfit? Uh, yes, I made the outfit myself. Uh, inspiration came from a lovely old book I have of a uh, Lillianne design. So I did a bit of tweaking and copying and uh, came up with this. Would you like to give us some of your tips for race wear and perhaps a couple of do's and don'ts? What's your key piece of advice for this year? Well, my, what works for me is I never follow the trends. I'm now here with Ian, the winner of the Stylish Gentleman at the Chadston Fashion Stakes. Congratulations, Ian. Were you expecting this win? Uh, no, not really. There's a bit of competition today, but um, it turned out all right, I think. And have you entered the stakes before? Not this event, no. no. Other events at other races, but not this one. Now, you are obviously very well dressed today. Would you like to tell us where your suit's from? Uh, the suit is a Ted Baker suit. Uh, it's a three-piece navy. Um, the rest of it I pretty much put together this morning. So I borrowed a shirt from a mate, a tie from another mate, and a hat which I also had on which I've taken off um, from another mate. So it was a bit of a stressful to get here, but once we got here it was all right. And I'm here today with Brodie Harper and Heath Meldrum. And we've been very lucky today. The weather's just cleared up perfectly. How have you two been enjoying the day so far? We've had a wonderful day so far. It's been a privilege to get to see Black Caviar race. And it's just a really nice, relaxing day. I actually really like Guinea's Day. It's a, it's a little bit more relaxed, a bit more laid back. Um, yeah, it's really good. What everyone would like to know is where your outfits are from because you just look gorgeous and you're both, there's a bit of matching and it looks fantastic. I don't know about matching, but um, we're both bright. This is a Nicolangelo dress. It just reminded me of a licorice all sort and the hat is Rebecca Cher so it's quite a new um, milliner she does beautiful things so that's what I have on and, uh, and this is a self-designed suit so this is one of my own yes my own uh, and then shirt and tie from Hugo Boss uh, yeah how are you enjoying your day so far Kev yeah it's going pretty good thanks Katie yeah it's uh, it's been a good experience I haven't been to races uh, very often so well, this is the way to start here in the Pegasus Club. We were talking just earlier about your style tips for girls, what you like seeing girls wearing at the races. Well, look, I'm probably, yeah, uh, I actually like the, you know, the floral dresses, the long flowing floral dresses. I'm here with James Brayshaw now, right next to the track. And how's your day been so far, James? Uh, it's been very good. Obviously, any day you see black caviar run around is a good day. Uh, and then I just dropped a bit on that last race there. I had a little crack at a moody horse, which obviously second and third, so. But look, I'm, I know nothing about horses. I'm here with the three daily finalists from the Chadston Fashion Stakes. Here we've got Joe, Cecilia and Laura in their beautiful outfits and I'm going to ask them a little about where they got their inspiration today. I just wanted to channel a modern day Audrey Hepburn look. So a little bit of the old with a little bit of the new to modernise it and still keep that classic ladies racing feel. I really just wanted to push the boundaries a little bit of race wear. Um, so I've still got the hem right but just wanted to up the ante with the colours. Um, my outfit was very last minute, so I thought classical never goes wrong. I'm very lucky to be backstage here with Connie and Angus from Sneaky Sound System, who will be performing later today at Caulfield. Now tell us a little bit about your new album. Oh my god, well it came out yesterday, which we're really excited about. You have to go and buy it, because it is amazing. And what should we expect from you in the performance coming up? Oh my god, like the best one ever. Is she going to pull out some crazy dance moves? I would suspect so. You know, we 
we just never know what to expect. It looks like, I think it's going to be good this afternoon. As you can see, it really is all happening here at Caulfield today. We've hung out with some really cool people, seen some incredible fashions and the horses. So I hope you've enjoyed our fashion and entertainment webisode because there really is nothing else like the spring racing carnival here at Caulfield. I'm Katie Murphy and I hope to see you here again soon.